when we are accessing the Akashic Records, when we are accessing the inner truth, some people prefer to have some kind of person or some kind of entity that is sharing with them the information. This is because our mind prefers a person, a specific person. Sometimes on the beginning of our journey, it's too complicated to just imagine that there is some information coming my way. Maybe you're going to be the person that it's going to be okay with you. We're just like, okay, this is just information flowing to me. But maybe you would prefer some kind of a person, entity. For example, angel or God or maybe source as sun or maybe mother nature. Maybe your spirit guides. So for me, the information that we are getting out of the Akashic Records, the information that we are taking from the inner wisdom, we can take it ourselves. And if we need support, we can ask these entities to help us. At the beginning of my journey, when I started reading in the Akashic Records for myself, I would see very often my spirit guide. And now, after years of reading, I don't see him that much because I can just feel his presence and I don't need anything more. But sometimes if I feel that I embark on some blockage, <laughs> that I don't know what's the information, like I cannot access it, then I'm just asking my spirit guide, please come in and help me. And then I can see him or even can feel him more because I put a face, I put, I ask the given energy to help me with understanding something. If you feel close to any kind of entity that you know it's the best for you and it's just pure light, you can just ask this specific person. So when we access the Akashic Records, when we are accessing the inner truth, let's imagine that it's the library, okay? And you're going to the library and sometimes you might need the help of the librarian to help you take some kind of book. So, but after some time, you don't need any librarian. <laughs> You're just going to the library and you know exactly where is the given shelf, where is the given book. So at the beginning, please remember that you can ask a given librarian, a given entity to help you. What I did sometimes is that when I went to the Akashic Records and some kind of process would begin and I would feel that, okay, I need some person that is for me just pure representation of love that would hold me and would be very forgiving because I felt I needed this energy and I asked Jesus to come and I could see Jesus coming I could feel his energy and he came because for me he's the representation of total forgiveness so please remember when you go into the Akashic Records you can use always support of the beings that want the best for you Okay, so now write down five energetical beings that you feel want the best for you. It can be God, it can be your spirit guides, garden angel, your spirit animal. It can be anybody that you feel that you are supported. And just write it down. Because if you write it down, it would be easier accessible for you when you later go to the Akashic Records, when you connect with the inner wisdom and you know that, oh, this is the five beings that I really feel connected to. So I can go back to and ask them for help if I don't know what is this information that I am receiving. 